Yeah, Mags and I uh, met in New Zealand. She was Yearling Manager at Cambridge Stud, uh, where she was there for 10 years. Mags perfected the art of Yearling Prep under the guidance of uh, Sir Patrick Hogan and Marcus Corbin. And uh, you know, those years were invaluable um, experience and um, understanding the, the way to prepare horses and the pressure of um, dealing with expensive bloodstock. And uh, we decided to come over to uh, Victoria in particular to uh, set up our own business. Uh, lot 130 is a Tavistock colt out of Starbelly and um, we call him Frank with his blue eyes, Frank Sinatra. Um, and uh, take away the fact that he's so flashy, um, what he is is a beautiful colt, well balanced, strong, very forward. So uh, really happy with his progress, he prepped up brilliantly and um, be interesting to see how he goes. Really happy with the result, 180,000 knocked down to Trent, Natalie Buston, um, first light racing, uh, you know, they know how to train stayers, derby winners, uh, the crosses work for them with Tavago, so I can't wait to see how this horse uh, progresses in his racing career. Since we uh, started our business, um, we have had uh, very quick success on the racetrack. Um, this year we had uh, Seabrook that has just gone on to win the Sweet Embrace in Sydney and is a, a life chance in the Golden Slipper. Seabrook the outside, it's Fiesta and Seabrook fighting it out, Fiesta and Seabrook, Seabrook's driving home best and Bowman gets the victory in home, Seabrook wore down Fiesta. Mags and I have the same opinion with the, the way we see Maluka going in the future and that's just um, continually um, improving the, the yearlings that we take to the sales, we've had great success so far, but uh, we, we want to bring the, as good a draft as we can each year.